Billy. Hello, Billy. Okay, I can talk to Billy. What's this? Charesse's caress. What? What is this? You. Oh. Turn around and toddle your way right back out of here. Everything in this barn has been donated for the refugees. Not you. Now piss off. What kind of things have people donated? Food, sundries, toys even. What would you expect for people who've lost everything? Now are you gonna clear off or not? I'd like to make a donation for the refugees, actually. Guess you're not all bad. Give it here and I'll make sure it's kept safely with the other donations. Donate some gold? I want to donate some supplies. I'd like to take the donations into the barn myself. I meant I'd bring my donations later. I'd like to take the donations into the barn myself. Oh, shoot. Hell yeah. There we go. Um, washing my pits, washing my pits. <laughs> I tempt, um, I tempt that followers <laughs> at a bad time. No, you didn't. Thank you so much. Um, okay, continue. Well, if you must, I suppose it saves me the walk. But if you're gonna do it, hurry up. Okay, sure. Okay. Look, they have a pig. Hey, pig. I say, terribly decent of you to come over and exchange pleasantries. Yeah, you're one of the most impressive pigs I've ever seen. Oh, how kind of you to say. I know. I have been growing my bristles out. It's something of an art, you see. Uh -huh. Great. Um, do you know... Salutations once more, old stick. Always a treat to have visitors. Okay. Can't really talk. Well... I'm needing to find... That teddy bear. I'm searching for a very particular set of donations. Uh, Nesta's warning. It seems I have to remind some of you that what is in the barn is for the refugees, not for your dinner. Next time I find skimming from the top clans that latrine for the rest of the month. Okay. Oh, we could have sneaked in. Of course we could have. There's always like 5,000 ways of dealing with this stuff, but... Uh, I guess I have to talk to them and like ask around where I can find those specific donations. Oh, are they here? Donations chest. Okay, there we go. The many tales of Mother Campestry. Okay. Well, I'm supposed to bring them here, so. What now? Let's keep to the shadows. Quietly. Forty-one. Do we just see that? Damn, sir. Uh, I like this guy being caring for these uh, people and being able to tell the player to piss off. Right? <laughs> Is that a talking pig? Okay, now I've seen everything. Yeah, there, there's a lot of talking animals in this game. Now, now, mind your tones. Leave Christine to me. 
It's a trap. And a nasty one at that. Oh god, a nasty trap. Investigate the suspicious toys. Can I disarm it? Oh, I saved. Come on, Asarin, you can do it. Let's go. There we go. 37. Who's that rummaging around in there? Show yourself! Whoopsie, sorry. You have two seconds to explain yourself before you're under arrest. <sighs> okay. I found a lot of toy bears rigged to explode, but don't worry, I disarmed them. What? Those are children's toys. W which means if a child had picked one up... Yep. I don't want to think about it. Yep. How do I know you're not the one who planted those explosives? I just wanted to see what's inside the barn. All right, all right. I was looking for stuff to steal. <laughs> Preservation. Why would I disarm my own explosives? I just want to find whoever is responsible. I was sent by the council to check up on your operations. Deception. Preservation. Oh, I'm better at deception. Then we're gonna do deception because I'm better at it. Poor inspiration. <sighs> nice. I had a feeling something was wrong in the barn. I wanted to make sure nobody got hurt. Take a look if you must. Never trust an honest person. This assignment was going to be dull. No such luck. Can you go? Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Gods, any one of us could have been blown to smithereens. Yeah, can I touch it? Well, hello. I mean, the starring is incredibly stealthy. Oh, you know what? You know what? Who would do what such to a do? thing? Surprise based teddy bear, so I can't look at them or anything. Okay, that's fine. Really took what's in the donation chest. Which is awful. Have a lot on my mind. Not saying it's not awful. <laughs> it's not awful that we we took what is theirs, right? Breathe deep and Oh, we got money from them. Thank you, thank you. I thank you. Appreciate it. Assignment was going to be dull. No such luck. But at least the children are not gonna be blown up, which is nice. I don't um seems like a good moment to talk. The pig is out. Hello, pig. Salutations once more, old stick. Always a treat to have visitors. Yeah, you are kinda, you know. The nation record? To take down So don't make trouble. Flaming first task by the city pil parliament with oversight of the gathering and distribution of donations to the refugees refugees in Riverton. Responded with what appears to be a half-hearted attempt to list donations and donors. The Double list the must amend, possibly We're to conceal persulation per by the fists, including the following entries. Ellen Elith, 9. Worn blankets of indifferent cleanliness. Lord Whitbud, 23. Male shoes, mid-size, suitable for urban wear only. Ethril Denthelion, 3. Sets of worn travel cookware and utensils. They were 3 or they get 3? 
Oh, they they donated nine warm blankets. It's not that Ellen Elif was nine, right? He got rid Pennywood. Six mus muslin pillows stuffed with human humanoid hair. Arthur. Oh, there we go. We're being replaced by steel Garigio, uh, 21 stuffed toy bears, unusually weighty. Nasir Greta, 16 books, all copies of Lord Gortish's memoirs. Esley Sharpie, 3 jars of um, preserved fish, 6 canisters of dried beans, small crate of rothy jerky, first aid supplies, blankets, cookware. This is a jumble. I'm not sorting through all of this. Can I donate something? Glad Nesta sorted out those trap toys. Nasty business, that. Can I give you some... I don't need you standing here gawking, thanks. Wow. Wow. Low. Oh, Mirkan. Oh my god, there's Mattis. Okay, let's first talk to Mattis. Hello. You did me a real favor clearing all those ghouls out of Moonrise. That old bone bag Ketherick had some fancy junk stashed behind all the cobwebs and piles of gore. Right? What do you think of Baldur's Gate? You looted Moonrise Towers! Didn't you? I did. Figured we only got the scraps you didn't have the strength to carry. Yeah, true. Uh, what do you think of Baldur's Gate? Wish I could tell you. We're stuck out here, but most of the action is beyond Worms Crossing. Show me these fancy items you have to offer anything magical. Would I try to fool a sharpie like you? Have a look. Supreme Elixir of Arcane Cultivation. Gain an additional level 4 spell slot. Replaces effects from other elixirs when drunk. Okay, that's really good though. Scabby... Poculus circlet. Material bravery. Your weapon and unarmed attacks deal an additional two damage while surrounded by two or more foes. That would be good for Karlak. Polymorph Dire Raven. Ooh, both of the Raven Queen. While wearing the amulet, your jump and flying speed increases by 1.5. While polymorphed or wild shape, you also gain feather fall. Ooh. I want this for... That is expensive, sir. Ugh, why do I have a heart? I want a stuffed teddy bear, sir. You can't really give me much... Much money, can you? a lot though ah ah it's okay it's okay what do we have here oh oh cloak of cunning broom cunning broom when the wearer disengages they also create a foggy cloud with two meter radius that lasts for one okay that's really cool i want that for a sorry and also that looks really pretty if you dare to steal from me from trap chests thanks uh wrong polymorph diarrhea nope uh lurk i forget to say good night i want to thank you for the coziest stream oh thank you so much jacob thank you so much and you're very welcome you've been part of a nice evening for me oh i'm so glad you had a really nice evening thank you so much for letting me know as well no, not <laughs> polymorph diarrhea, but yeah, I don't know how to pronounce it. Um, but thank you so much. Um, well, maybe I should armor class plus one, saving throw plus one. I'm probably gonna wear this now. Oh, this is so tiny. I like mine more, but mine doesn't give me anything. It just looks nice. Ooh. Oh, well, this also looks weird. A little weird, but it's okay. Do I wanna... No. No. It looks nice, but this is better. It actually gives me something. And it kind of looks good with what I'm wearing right now. And Starion's is... Well. <laughs> well. It, it does it does something for him here, right? Looks kind of cool. Kind of cool. Maybe Lizelle can wear this one. 
Also, I need to uh, let's save. Also, good night. If you if you can't say good night anymore, good night, uh, Jacob. Eager for battle. Yeah, you need to go to camp for a second because I need to cloak you. Open up. We have, oh yeah, no, the Soul Breaker Great Sword sounds great. Sounds great. Can't really say anything. We have to sell them though. Um, but we had a Githy Yankee. Oh, Catherine Shield. You gain a plus one bonus to spell safety C and spell attack rolls. Shield. Okay. Why am I not using that? Reaper's Embrace. Magical Plate. What is that? Very rare heavy armor. Howl of the Dead. Okay. All income and damage is reduced by two. Reaper's Rigidity. When activated, you can't be moved against your will by any spell or act. Okay, why am I not using that? Disadvantage of stealth checks. Yeah, but... I think this is what I want to... Okay, this one, I can send this to either Shadowheart... Because I think she can wear heavy armor. I think she already is. Battle Mage's powers. Battle Mage. When weapon attacks, roll, inflicts a condition, the wheel gains arcane. Ah, uh, well. <laughs> ah. <laughs> um, yeah, this one. I, I will. I will wear that one. Umber trousers. Lazelle's clothes. Historian. Let's see. Amulet of branding. Brand the weak. Saluna's amulet. Okay, I think we're good. Uh, plate armor. Well, this one is better. This is 18 and this is 15. But if, if a gift wears it, she has more from it than this. So I guess that's better. Okay. Leave camp. One more dereliction of duty. And you're all going no to, to wait. The and you have the rare heavy armor, 18, and this one is 19. Okay. Oh. Hello, Shadow. Damn. Oh, yeah, that's Catherick's armor. Is it? Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting I think it time. is. I wasn't expecting it, but I'm glad to have some company on this journey. Yeah, that is Catherick's armor. <laughs> well, you can wear it now. Because the Starian can't wear heavy armor. It won't look good in the Starian, but... Well. Still breathing. Also... <sighs> Enough time wasted. Yeah. Battle awaits. Have a short rest. Uh, Mirkon? Oh, hi! me again i don't really need to be saved right now good thing huh bye bye glad you don't need to be saved i don't want to save you all the time honestly i mean i am but i don't want Ooh, chevy wooden doors what is this what is this light on my feet citizen back off and return to your homes Jeez. I mean, yeah, things happened. 
I don't think things happened here, but things happened. Let's go up here. I want to see what happened. Around here. What? That's curious. What? Dirt Seems mount? Ah. Um. Ah. Nice. Wooden chest. Ooh, scroll of sunbeam. I take that. Thank you very much. That was a lot of money. I appreciate it. Let's open these doors. Uh, a strange ox. Ox again. Hmm. What's that? I can talk to the strange ox again. Hello. No, incapable. I show you incapable. I remember you from the druids grove. Are you ready to reveal your secrets yet? I show you incapable. I remain unshown. I remember you from the Druid's Grove. Are you ready to reveal your secrets yet? Not for you to know. Oh, come on. Now that you... Pick at my curiosity. Perception. Percep... Oh, persuasion? Okay, perception. You're the ox I met back in the grove. You were very hungry then. I saved you all and now you have food. Nature, you are a rare breed. An authentic red-backed river ox. I thought you'd be more discerning. I'm gonna try to do the persuasion. Ah, come on. Now you pick up my curiosity. There we go. Boom. Continue. Well. Come close. Your mind to mine. Are you satisfied? What the fuck? Those are the least bovine thoughts I've ever seen. What are you really? Keep quiet, and you won't have to find out. Whatever you are, you're coming out of hiding now. All I wanted was a bit of hay, a good brushing, and a clean stall. The simple life! Is that so much to ask? Help the devilish ox. What the hell are you? What is that? Immune to acid? Well, that's okay. Oof. Swift and lethal. That is so weird. resistance, slashing resistance, lightning resistance. Okay, but I could do a really intense inflict wounds on it. Like intense intense. Come on, Shadow Art, do it. Ooh, nice. Well, we don't need it. Give in. 
Now you are a sheep. Go for the throat. Okay, enter, 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 enter. Oh. Are you dead now? I don't think I'll ever look at an ox quite the same. Yeah, that was weird. That was indeed weird. Shapeshifter's boon ring. Shapeshifter's boon. While shapeshifting or disguising yourself, you gain plus on all checks. Okay, that's insane. Um, Shadow Blade. You know what? Okay, Starin's are pretty good. You can have the Shadow Blade. I'm gonna have that one because... I can actually shapeshift. <laughs> See? I can be whatever I wanna be. So that's really cool. Okay. Uh, interesting. Oh yeah, we did that. Okay then. If not over, then through. The simple life of an ox. Oh, that took the edge off. Interesting. Ah, and then you can go up here and then jump down and then try and go into the barn, I guess. Okay, interesting. Well, we could go up here. Maybe look at this. Maybe. Who knows? Anyhow. We came from here, didn't we? Yeah, we came from here. Solaris. So we need to go down here now. If my friend tries to get you to invest, kindly turn her down. She doesn't need the encouragement. I if I that. hire the refugees, then I get cheap labor and they get coin. It's a good deal for everyone. Think about it. They're stuck here with no coin and nothing to do. I mean, yeah, it depends on what you want. You're going to hire all the refugees. Just like that. Of course. Cleaning, cooking, construction, the possibilities are endless. All this kerfuffle over missing rat caps. Yes, we'd caged them due to unruly behavior, but as our rat cap cleaners demonstrate, most are perfectly harmless. Red caps are not harmless, sir. Hey, red cap. Keep a sharp eye out. Red caps are on the loose. One's deemed too violent to work. And not one of these circus folks seem bothered by it. Circus poster. The circus of the last days has returned. See Dryad's Gin and Dribbles the Clown back with a new act. Sorry. Of course. You have he never travels without his friends. Working in your Let's circus. Go. But the creepy oh, yes. monster. I want to see Dribbles, but I don't like the monster at the door. Yeah. Please go ahead of us. My son is a little nervous. Okay, let's save. I don't yet want to go into the circus, Montgomery. Stinks of cheese between his piggy toes. How dare you? What in the hell is all of this? A necessity, good sir. The Steel Watch loves pretending sweet Rivington doesn't exist. So we have decided to protect you, dear patrons. <laughs> no need to thank us. You'll be allowed in once I've done this batch. Next! 
Hello, hello, and welcome to the Circus of the Last Days, the finest extra planar circus there is. I've never heard of an extra planar circus. We travel from plane to plane, thrilling all, blessed to see us. From tempestuous Ginny to belligerent red caps, you'll find them all here. But enough of this. The circus is a place of joy and distraction, so uh, come inside and forget your worries. All right, I'd like to enter the circus. Not a problem, dear patron. Benji just has to check if you're a vicious murderer. Benji? <laughs> I can am. Brain juice smells like piss and iron. No like. Oh, well, that's a first. Usually I'd allow you in, but in these times, I can take no chances. Move along. No circus for you. Bard deception. I've actually just been hired. Uh, meet your new bard. Meet your new bard. Okay. Uh, cool. Intimidation. Let me and I snap you in two. I'm not a threat to you or anyone else in the circus, I swear it. Yeah, bot deception. Let's go. I'm the new bot. How are you doing, sir? Now we can do it, even if we have a one. Boom, boom, boom. Oof. Viola Silvertongue won't be happy. Oh, well, she should have practiced those high notes. Yep. Welcome to the circus, a motley crew of misfits and morons. <laughs> We're happy to have you. Nice. Seams of lavender in time. Charlatan. Inspiration gained. We love it. Was oh, that a dragonborn? Okay, this is fun. Findor? What's that monster? That's just a man in the car. Armor, blades, the Rivington Jet. I don't know if I yet want to go into the into the circus. I think I wanna I wanna be back. Garethin, Red, Yvonne, let's talk. Dad says there's already too many refugees, and the city can't hold any more. We've got to keep them out. Any of the refugees give you hassle, come to us. We know how to handle them. Damn, sir. A Baldurian. Good. Lots of unfamiliar faces in the city these days. Heroic portrait of Gortesh. Wow, can reach. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, smithing sign. Hello. Gildro. Gildro Angel. Iron the Smith. Okay, let's go. That was a whole lot of a name. Welcome, adventurer. I take it you're new to Rivington. No doubt you came here to choose from my fine selection of weapons. Yes, I seem to have it all. Clubs, swords, maces, bows, cutting and gutting galore. Why don't we see if we can find the perfect weapon for you? Sure. How will you know my perfect weapon? I provide a personalized service for my customers to make sure the weapon I choose is the perfect fit. Tell me, how do you like to kill? Oh, but I like to hum a little funeral dirge at a sense of occasion. I see, playing to your strengths, keeping things simple. And when you kill someone, what do you feel? Bard, inspired, the rush of adrenaline does wonders for my creative process. Killing holds no fear for you, does it? You understand what it takes and what it gives. 
Sure, One sure. more question, if you'll humor me. Do you think you could turn your weapon on those closest to you? I would never kill someone I care about. You'll do so much worse by the time I'm done with you. Oh, shit. So, you're the lick spittle who crushed the Bone Lord's thrall. <laughs> Have you come b begging, sniffing for our stones? Gortash won't like that. A throat his black hand can't choke the spit from. He'll find your weaknesses, stick a knife in the cracks and prize you apart. Unless you get him first. Oh, shit. When you find the Lordling, tell him... Orin is watching. So Orin is a shapeshifter. How long has she been watching? Ah, yeah. You! Try attacking me when my back isn't turned, you bloody coward. Oh, shit. I didn't attack you. I've been out here the whole time. Uh, you were attacked by a doppelganger. She was impersonating me. Is that so? You've got some evil twin running round, whacking people round the back of the head. I'll tell you now, you'll be seeing bloody double when I'm done with you. Hallucinations, irrational anger, these are symptoms of a serious head injury. I just told her I would never use my sword against the ones I cared about. And she has been watching me, so she knows about a starry enemy. Oh my god, I hate this. You must have been attacked by my twin. She's a real handful. Okay, nice. Wow. You'd better knock some sense into that bloody thug before I do. Hard enough trying to make a bloody living without some moron cracking your skull for no good reason. I need a bloody drink. Go on, clear off. I've seen enough of your face today. It's not enough. We have a gallery of villains to look out for, but now we could be infiltrated by a shape changer. I can't even tell if any of you are acting strange because you've been replaced or because this group is full of weirdos. <laughs> that is so true. I mean, we are a group full of weirdos. Come on, you know when it's me. <sighs> Can we? I suppose we can. Can we not have like a safe word? <sighs> can we not have a safe word, dudes? Uh, <laughs> uh, I should have I should have taken a long rest before we did this. See if anybody had anything to say after we went. Ah. Uh, 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 I feel like I ah oh, no I'm not gonna I'm not I'm not I'm not gonna safe scum this one nope nope I should not Orin Skra burn away the shadows she hides in tear off her mask and you'd reveal her for what she is a shivering child a shivering huh <sighs> Orin's little display was just intended to rattle us. Yeah. We mustn't let her succeed. We need to stay alert all the same. Yeah. Very well so. 
Oh my god, if this woman touches any one of my companions, I tell you. Oh. Hello, little hatch. Careful, I might. Oh, we can use it just. Okay. No one back home will ever believe this. It's locked. From the other side. I wonder where it leads. Huh. Remind them that this is ours. We will find out. She can be anybody. She was just a smith, a blacksmith. Uh, and I told her, I told her I would never touch my uh, people. Hold on. Very well. be uh, I was so stupid. I told her my weakness, like right in her face. Uh. I ain't looking to make friends or enemies. Go bother someone else. I don't want to bother anyone. I just want to cry. <laughs> you look like you need to clean off the road, Dad. Almost as much as I do. No good ends with hot water and a tub on this side of the crossing, though. Yep. If you're after a job, Neverwinter is on the lookout for adventurers. That's where we're headed. Here for a bit. Also, isn't we? Uh, where is that? Who has the? There we go, sentient amulet. Seem to sleep indoors. My face protects me. Also, we should just disguise ourselves, honestly. Um, Hells of Dead. Um, Moonbeam, talk to the sentient amulet. The amulet is heavy, but holds a subtle warmth. Like it was left under the sun. Suddenly the metal surges with heat. You feel great power and an overwhelming urge to laugh. <laughs> Can thou endure? Dunkers, hello, how are you doing? Welcome in. Um okay, cleric of Saluna. <gasps> we now okay, we are now a cleric of Saluna. That's very fun. Okay. Wisdom, summon your light and devotion as you push back. She can okay, that makes sense. Ooh, natural 20. I'm here from YouTube. Oh, nice! Thank you for, like, checking out the Twitch uh, stream. And I hope you are enjoying the, the YouTube side as well. <laughs> okay. Your faith and dedication surrounds you, forming an impenetrable shield. Thou hast done well. For what is a laugh if not one step toward madness? <laughs> Thou art the one. Return me, take me home, and thou shalt glow with blessings. Didn't we have this talk again, though? Oh, you goes. What happened? I could barely. Uh, I okay. I found Worms Crossing. Where is your granddaughter? Shira has devoted her body and soul to Elmata. Find her at the Open Hand Temple. Okay. Uh, examine the amulet. Keep the amulet equipped. Stow the amulet. You feel a chuckle coming on, but it soon okay. fades. Um. I am a little- Oh, that's nice. Thank you so much. I'm really glad that it can bring you some enjoyment. Thank you for the YouTube videos. You're very welcome. I have a question, if you don't mind me asking it. Yeah. What class is your faith? I think the bard, actually. I really enjoy the bard. It's a lot of fun to, um... To roleplay as a bard. And I think it's a very nice addition to the, um, to the party. And I also think that the bard is like super strong. Um, and again, a really good addition to like everybody else is super strong as well. But you have the arcane and you have the 
um, damage from also like your sword or whatever. So I really, really like it. Yeah, it's it's a lot of fun as well as like the um, the dialogue options you get as well. Uh, should we should we have a sleep? My favorite class is the sorcerer with the monk being a close second. Yeah, I have not yet played as a uh, monk. Wait. Do we know Belron? I need a quick word. Do we know Belron? Wait. If you're looking to enter the city, no. hope your pockets are loaded. Bastards are charging a fortune. Uh, okay. But you heard Boulder's Gate was safe, right? Well, it's a bloody lie. They've banned refugees from the city as if we're the problem. Um. <sighs> There's a fly. <laughs> my favorite class. Okay, yeah. My permanent build is multi class of Source Ramok. I still have to dwell into multi classing. I would also like to have a ro. Oh, is that Ilmanta? The open hands. Yeah, that looks like Ilmanta. So I guess we can do that. Cormac. Hello. Can I help you? Oh, bloody ribs. Sorry, mate. Had a run in with a mugger. If you need something, ask the missus. Okay. Hello, Bridget. Don't wander around Rivington alone, all right? My husband did and got mugged and beaten for his trouble. I like their clothes, though. Can we, like, change into our clothes? Can we just... Oh. Oh. Oh, I... <laughs> I forgot to change it back. Well, whoops. I mean, I could give a star in his petted armor again, right? Oh, I can't because it's armor. Great. Well, I, I, I can't make him walk around. Well, I can Yes, darling. I very well can. <laughs> okay, wait. Um, do I still have my cam clothes on me? No, I don't. Well, Starian, I'm very sorry. <laughs> Put his armor on him again. Well, he's full of blood either way. It's just nicer to walk around in our like cam clothes. Though I mean, Lazelle could also. I mean, put on a little bit more. But you know. It's nice to walk around in like actual clothes rather than armor in the city. It's run or sit on my Would everyone please stop going on about the Absolute's army? Lord Gortash is going to sort it all out. We'll see. Can we talk about your uh, dress? lady that is very interesting especially with your head the absolute army is on our doorstep you want to live get out of here before it's too late can we walk through the city at night that would be very interesting mommy keeps talking about some army but she won't tell me anything about it i'm not a baby but you're a kid probably shouldn't Talk about it with you, refugees, okay. Ah, <sighs> well I guess you should wear it for now. Please in the name of the crying one have mercy. The priests will open the temple up again. You will see. They're good people, holy people. 
if you're looking for Il Martyr's charity, you're out of luck. They've turned their backs on us, like everyone else. Can I please have some food? Oh, sorry. I thought you were a priest. Oh, I could still give you some food. No, we scramble. Take me to my cherished sure, and I will shall be plenty. Okay. Let's see. There's enough blood to make. The fuck are you? Okay. Is that a bathing house? Oh my god. Hello. I mean, it's not really a bathing house, right? The crying one weeps today. Our father Logan is dead. Murdered. What happened? I... I don't want to talk. My heart is in mourning. Okay. Do we do everything your dad tells you? Okay. What happens if I go into the water? Do I heal? No. Nothing really happens. Okay, I want to talk. I want to talk to. <laughs> I want to talk to that thingy, Valeria. Hello. Who is you? What is you? Look, investigator. Brilgor might have been a criminal, but he was no murderer. You're missing something. You have to be. Enough, Yanis. Listen to yourself. You are defending a man who ritually slaughtered your high priest. The evidence speaks for itself. Brilgore killed Father Lorgan, then, be it out of shame or profane duty, offed himself with the same blade. Case closed, Sister Yanis. Hello. Shitey little elephant. Oh, um, I apologize, stranger. Language like that hardly befits a rector of ill mater. Sounded like you were having quite the disagreement. Don't apologize, sounded like a lot of bullocks anyway. I wouldn't go that far. But the investigator is being particularly challenging right now. Two people just died on temple grounds. Our high priest, Father Logan, and one of the new refugees, Brilgor. Investigator Valeria thinks it's a murder and is content to blame Brilgor. The politically convenient target. This place fancy, hell yeah. If you think the investigator did a shooty job, I can look into the murder for you. Feel free to look around the temple. But fair warning, the investigator won't change her mind without significant new evidence. Where can I find the investigator? Charette's caress would be my best bet. Sure. That's her usual haunt after closing a case. Any idea what I should be looking for? Valeria never found the murder weapon, so that could be a start. Anything disproving the refugee murder suicide angle, really. Can you tell me where to find Shira Clawin? I can tell you where to find her, but she won't be very chatty, I'm afraid. Shira passed away last year. Peacefully, mine. We buried her in the crypt under the temple, if you wish to visit. I really hope you find something. For all our sakes. Ooh. There is work to do. Can you talk to the thingy again? Thou shalt return to me. <laughs> Thou shalt have my blessing. She's dead. I'm afraid your grand granddaughter has passed away. <laughs> This cannot, must not, shall not be! <laughs> you must open her tomb in the open hand temple, post haste. She may bless us, even beyond the veil. <laughs> you feel a chuckle coming on, but it soon fades. Sure. Okay. Is that blood? No, never mind. 
Okay. The Order of Ilmanta service. Better not be cursed. Let's see. On my way. Father Logan. Logan's chest key. I'm just gonna take his money. Don't you worry. What ails you? Marsh fever? Feather lung? Be quick, I've not got all day. Elf, my ear points are a bit dry right now. You'd interrupt me for something like that? Just rub a bit of aloe on. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got a dead high priest to see to. Indeed, I'm investigating his death and have some questions. What do you want to know? Do you think, who do you think killed Father Logan? How did he die? How badly wounded was he? How did he die? Slowly. Logan was a good man, if naive. He deserved better. One of the refugees killed him. Cruelly, too. They cut off his hand, sawed right through the bone. I found a paralytic poison on one of his wounds. Logan was alive while they took the hand. He just couldn't scream. It's sick. We give them everything, and all we get is nothing but a good man to bury. Anything else? Please, leave me be. I've got an awful lot to get done. Okay. can just take the <laughs> take the um, picture with me and it's okay so there was no murder weapon here okay so they Ma wh what make love to the air You call that a poop? Wait, what? Oh, I love this. What the hell? Oh, you. There's hands. Okay. So you could sneak into. Interesting. Interesting. So you could sneak into the circus as well. Of course you can. Okay. I'm an investigator, okay? Who are you, Brother Dominic? Did you want to eat his hand? I've said all I have to say already. Now I just want to pack up my kitchen and leave. Uh, True Wolf, how are you doing? What are the odds? How are you? I'm dorky and nerdy at once. Hell yeah, same. <laughs> how are you doing? Hope you're doing well. Hiya, hello. Um, I'm investigating Logan's murder. What do you know? I know it's not fair. This was the best job I ever had. Logan was kinder than most. And now they're blaming a refugee for his death. Typical. Where are the bodies? So you think Brulgar killed him? Can you think of anyone who'd want to kill Logan? Some folk didn't like how he looked after the refugees. I know this game will take forever. I don't yeah. think they'd kill him for it. At least, I hope they wouldn't. That's a scary thought. But it's amazing as well. Ooh. Ornate wooden hatch, okay. I need to go down there, so. <sighs> Let's see. Are these the crates? There's blood. There's a lot of blood here. Um, rites of the Passing. Book of Ill Mantry Death Rites. The page on the turning is particularly dark 
eared. There will come many there will come many a time a worship tormented that you will have to comfort a faithless unfortunate as they pass from this life to the next. Or perhaps even more distastefully, you may be faced with the dying acolyte of a wretched god, keen to shirk the blasted afterlife awaiting them. The Lord on the Rack grants us to um a Wait, oh my god, it's late. Okay, grants us a great many powers, but altering the moral velocity of a soul is one we cannot shift on the deathbed. If one has lived a life of sin, their soul is bound for a sinful place, no matter their final protestations. However, it would do much more harm than good to tell them this. Ilmanta does not forbid the speaking of untruth, no matter how polite society deems the act. If it would spare the dying wretch, some suffering as they pass, tell them that the weeping God awaits them with his balming embrace. Make them believe whatever torment their soul bears in the realms beyond. It remembers not their body to spare them, at least this final passing moment from hardship. Okay. Oh, that looks interesting. Looks a little bit like no. It looks like it could go on. Maybe it doesn't. 